I think it is important for everybody to have a faith and a belief in themselves. If you have a strong faith and belief in yourself, then you're going to be able to reach out and help other people. You're not going to become discombobulated the first time you have a little bit of problem or a little bit of difficulty. I don't believe that you can be productive if you don't have a great deal of confidence in yourself and in your future. You show me somebody's petty, negative, jealous, I'll show you somebody who has a poor self-image. In a world of competition, we always have a tendency to think, gee, everybody else seems to be better than me. 95% of the people believe that. A lot of people think it's because of looks. I used to believe that way. Looks doesn't have a thing to do with self-image. People are always going to put us down. 1988, we're 10-0, number one in the country. We go Southern Cal, we play them, they're 10-0, number two. We beat them 27-10, I feel like a million dollars. Next day, we have a Notre Dame prayer breakfast. We then go to Disneyland. We go into Disneyland, and they have these photographers. They ask to take a picture of our captains with Mickey Mouse and Donald Duck. And they asked me to pose for a picture. On my left, they put Pluto, and on my right, they put Goofy. <laughs> I thought it was a little weird, didn't say anything. The picture that appeared in the L.A. Times on that Monday after Thanksgiving was a picture with myself, Pluto, and Goofy, and that's what the caption said. Here's Lou Holtz, head football coach of Notre Dame Fighting Irish at Disneyland with Pluto and Goofy. Nothing wrong with that. What upset me was the next sentence, because it was in bold capital letters. It said, Lou Holtz is the one in the middle. <laughs> to me, our success at Notre Dame and the reason you've been successful and the reasons why you'll continue to be successful is self-image.